Field with Neo. So the goal here is to get through the rest of Dream of the Demon. Um, I'll still have to knock out every mission in the game, of course. Uh, but that's that's something else to worry about. For now, we just gotta worry about knocking this bitch out and uh, unlocking the next region. So, thankfully, we don't have a ton to do. We we made good progress uh, the other night, knocking out all the the various dual missions, Shibata, and all that. Uh, so now we just got a couple more that we gotta knock out, and then we're home free. So, a scented letter. This one, this one I can solo. This one's fast. We'll bang this one out first. Uh, for those curious, next week, I'm still, well, I'm still debating. Uh, I'm, I'm already working on Mortal Shell. What is this? Wow. Um. I'm working on recording Mortal Shell right now for the Let's Play. I'm still debating if I want to do a walkthrough for it. It's very open-ended. That's all I'll really say right now because I can't, I can't talk about it. But um, I don't know. It it would be. I'll just say this. It would be harder to do a walkthrough for Mortal Shell than it was for something like Neo or Dark Souls. I think. The Paralyze is insane! What the hell was that? I already said I can't talk about it, man. Come on, no questions. Like, multiple ending or lots of... I can't talk about it. I can't talk... I, I know. I know y'all want details. You'll get details... on Monday. Until Monday, you just gotta sit tight. People can join the stream. I'm just gonna, I'm banging out this part. Uh, so this is a really short level, so I'm just knocking this one out. Uh, but the longer missions, I'll be pulling people in. Like a Demon Souls remake early? That's up to Sony. I don't decide these things. If I did, I would get every game early. If it was up to me, I would get everything, everything early. But I do not make those decisions. Yeah, plus it's we're way too early. Demon Souls is going to be a 2021 thing. Let me do a bum 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 Bro, why you gotta be like that? Let 
a sleepy old man. Any thoughts or wishes on Neo 2 DLC new weapon? Uh, I have none. I wanted a three section staff. I'm using a three section staff right now. So the weapon that I wanted has been added into the game. I can do everything. I can fucking make this bitch extend and do all kinds of crazy shit. Like there's whatever, whatever they add at this point, it could be great. It could be disappointed. Wouldn't care. I'm like, I already got my, my box got checked. So anything else is just a bonus at this point for me. Alright, let's do Senate Leather, and we'll summon some folks up for this one. PlayStation, my guess is going to be probably like 550 and 500 for the digital, or something like that. The, the, the pure digital one. If the digital one is going to be the same price, they'd have to have it come with like a bigger hard drive or something. Offset the cost of the Blu-ray drive. Um, bum, 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 bum. Oh, hang on. Hang on. I mean, uh, how do I... Submenu, withdraw. Submenu, change settings. Put that back to booty. We were doing scroll farming the other day. All right, here we go. Bum, 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 bum. Bonk. Staff gang. Staff gang! was good. Bro, all right, that's it. I'm going around and beating this guy's ass. Where's he at?
Mm, yada? No. No. To be fair, I wasn't trying to get a yada. They haven't added a purity arcana yet, right? Because that would be so nice to have. Yeah, there's a lot of fake queens that have been coming into my chat. They all just want to be the real queen and share in her and dying love for me. Well, I mean, we have the Ho Spirit. You could use Ho High Stance. I wonder if we'll get Purity Arcana with the, uh, the next patch. Oh, I don't remember where the hell to go on this mission. I got purity shots now. I just don't want to deal with having to forge a purity Ben's Tampa. Cody, welcome to Booty Nation. I do think we have a corruption spirit coming. Hey, where, where are you going? Get back here. Ooh, we got a scroll on this revenant, boys. Drop the scroll. Yeah, baby. Staff gang. Might as well open the chest, we're here. <laughs> Neo co-op at its finest. Shake, jiggle, jiggle. It's like a puppy.
I mean, people are excited about Mortal Shell, but keep in mind, it's like a dev team of 15, so not exactly a ton of people to coordinate the launch. Like, if there was a shit ton of people, it'd be a different story, but... These are both dookie. Let's check. Let's see the new scrolls. Elemental damage. Ooh, a new melee damage scroll. Rarity transference. I... Ooh, Wyra? Hold the fuck up. All I gotta kill is a Wyra and a Toxic Slime? Bro, what is this? This is like the easiest scroll ever. Unless there are like 20 of these slimes. Do you like having the color effects? I don't mind it. I don't lose track of where people are. I'm not... I think the best way to say it is I am not... So, I, I am not like one way or another like, oh yeah... No, ow, what are, you, what are you doing that for? Stop that. Sir, sir, this is very rude. I thought it was just going to be slimes and Wyra. What is all this extra bullshit? Killer umbrellas. And ninja dogs. I thought I put fire on one of those. Was it the top? Oh, Jesus Christ, it's another Wyra. Carnage. What would I put these points on? Yeah, no, I thought I had an Arcana on though. E consumption. I do. It's my mid stance split stuff. Blood Bloodborne remaster is nothing more than a rumor. Please don't get excited, only to be disappointed. Only Souls thing confirmed for PS5. Oh, 3.8? What is this garbage? Oh my god. Bro, I'm throwing that out. That is just straight trash. The only Souls game we know for sure is the Blood or uh, the Demon Souls remake. That's it. No Sekiro 2. No, Dark Souls 4. Um, Bloodborne has not been confirmed. I literally just Googled it. Bloodborne remaster rumored. Once again, rumored. Rumored.
I don't think Elden Ring is going to be a Souls-like. And we still know fuck all about it. Yes, the video you saw today. Matthias, listen, man. I know people at Sony. I know people at From Software. It is a rumor. Until you see an announcement from either Sony or FromSoft that says we are excited to announce Bloodborne is being remastered for the PS5 with updated 4K graphics and blah, 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 blah. Until you see that, it's a rumor. What I recommend for a Dachi build? Uh, not playing Odachi, no. Uh, but in all seriousness, probably still Ben's. Probably still Ben's. Ben's is, uh, Ben's is Ben's. Ben's aid, man. Believe in the Ben's aid. Oh, you bitch! You interrupted my dope. Oh, you're fucked now. cyberpunk streaming now that it's been delayed uh yeah probably i mean from what we've from what we have seen cyberpunk looks like it'll be too big of a game uh to just do a youtube series on i think i'm gonna have to stream it just to make any kind of progress with it God. I thought I had my heel on and instead I had feathers on. We have cats. Mine constantly shits on the floor with a clean litter box. Why? Uh, get a bigger litter box, maybe? Some cats can be really picky. So, I mean, it could be the size of the litter box. Uh, it could be that the cat just fucking hates the litter that you're using. But if the cat's shitting on the floor... It's clear that there is a problem, which is why I would suggest you first clean the litter box. The litter box is clean. Change the litter. If you change the litter and the litter's clean and the cat's still shitting, it's time to look into a new litter box. Ow, fuck. I've been playing too much Mortal Shell. Come here, you dumb bitch. No, you get off my wife. Yeah. Yeah. 
Get her a bigger litter box. For honor is still terrible. Or if for honor is, is still terrible, still garbage. If for honor is still garbage from the patch they dropped. Uh, is that Fall Guy stream entirely that? Yes. If for honor is uh, dookie mode, we're going to be focusing on uh, Fall Guys. Oh my god. You bitch. Somebody's in a corner. Well, that means they're dead. Metamorphosis is pretty fun. I'll probably play more of that. fighting uh, Kaloka. Not bullshit. Well, I finished the first part of We Happy Few, and then it turned into like a baby simulator where you had to like stop playing the game to feed your kid and change your kid and 
all this other bullshit, and I was like, this isn't fun anymore. Like, I get it, babies are responsibilities, but... Like, who the fuck wants to play a game where you have to constantly be reminded to take care of a baby every 30 minutes to an hour? August update to Grizz. The game finished? Hell no, dude. Game still early access. This is like the first early access update. Grounded won't be done till sometime in 2021. I mean, I'm excited for the baby, obviously. Kasha, stop, stop running. No, you gotta st stay still. Alright, fine. Let me get my stacks up. Stop backing up with your fucking Hot Wheels. You dumb bitch. I mean, if she would just stand and fight. She gotta be jumping all over the damn place. Needs to stand in the corner and just let me dragon dance her. Charge ain't bad. It's kind of dookie though. All right, how close are we? Oh my god, still so many missions. Right, Kasha just ha 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 I think I'm going to probably do more streaming with this next one, but there's a game called Star Renegades that is like a tactical JRPG meets Guardians of the Galaxy. I don't even know how to describe it, but it looks badass. So I'm going to be getting into that. It's like all all old school graphics and 2D. Um, I'm going to I'm going to do at least one YouTube episode to kind of maybe like this is the game. And then I'm probably going to stream it. Because JRPGs are usually better streamed. Any thoughts on Wasteland 3? If it's the one I think it is, I looked into it and decided it wouldn't be something I'd enjoy. Let me let me Google. Let me let me Google it. Wasteland 3. Wasteland 3. 
is oh yeah that's the one where it's it's like it's almost like an XCOM right yeah I'm not gonna play that I suck at those XCOM type games that's a uh, I'll let Christopher Odd handle those I am not a uh, I'm not I'm not good at those games to be honest I'm just not I don't have the patience and I inevitably end up getting myself killed doing dumb shit so it's better that I just leave those to somebody that knows them. When should done DoD do you be posting an update at Ben's I-10 build with different cores? Um, I might. I might. I'm thinking about making a pair of Tomfas and using those in the build just as a little clapback. Outer Worlds. I got, I got bored of Outer Worlds. Outer Worlds was just not the game for me. Part of me wants to roll Benz that has active, like... I know it would take ages with doing uh, active skill damage on my bends. I'd have to spend like an entire weekend just rolling, but like, and in terms of just things that would be good, um, ideally this this should be active star key damage. This should be active star or uh, act active skill damage, and then active skill damage. If I had active skill damage on both of those pieces. Um, I'd be fucking happy, but rolling a Benz and a star at the same time, it just, it takes hours and hours of work. Unless you just use cheat engine. Yo, let's surround him. Surround him. Everybody, everybody surround him. So that when we start... Everyone surround him. We're gonna, we're gonna, no, 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 we're gonna triple... We're gonna... Surround him. Oh, we didn't do it. I wanted to make a triangle of, of our thing, so he's like, bang, 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 just bouncing all over. Enar, you gotta get in the triangle with us, man. The triangle has three sides, and you're over here just spamming magic. We need to form our triangle of death. Alright, this guy is, does not want to die. He's in the corner. There we go. Now, he's pinned. 
Yo, wait, he is healing. Why are you healing? Stop healing. No, get back in that corner. What the fuck? Why is he like invincible, bro? Oh my god! <laughs> Yo, he's like, I will never die. Jesus. Dude, that was nuts. He refused to go down. He was like, no. No. guy has like block key reduction 900% or some shit. Oh man. Welcome to Dream of the Demon. Nah, there's no way Cyberpunk's gonna come out as a letdown. Hack inheritable. Mm. Well, that region's done. I guess let's finish up Twilight. Fire God and Fragments. Dude, he would not go down. He was just, he refused. Can we split up and go get different fragments? the loot I don't even know you could knock those big boys off like that
Alright, y'all go that way, I'll go this way. We'll meet up after. Oh wait, we can we can split up. Oh. I ain't so basic that I can't handle a thing on my own. Oh, I think it warped in here. Oh, what the fuck? Let me up top. Dodge that. Just hang on to him for now. Um, I think this is it for this region. Still, still so close. So did it warp y'all over? Oh yeah, we got new scrolls. Extended yokai shift. It's new. God, that is so garbage. Three point eight. Three point eight. Who wants a three point eight scroll? Yes, correct. This is pre-Neo 1. I have to redo them or need an item for what? Oh, the scrolls? You just do them over and over and over again. It's just rinse and repeat, man. You just keep doing. You do the scroll, and then you do it, and then you do it, and then you do it. It takes a long time. I was 
busy putting on juke. Stop that shit. Punch him in the dick. Motherfucker, I swear to God. Do you want your dick punched? Because this is how you get your dick punched. Trying to put my shit on. Dude over here attacking me and shit. This way, right? We don't gotta kill everything here. We just gotta. Damn, you slow as hell. Yeah. Skeleton sat there like, wait a minute. Piece of moon prayer, two piece for DOTD? Probably not, man. The thing is, you can you can start DOTD with almost anything. Starting DOTD is fine. It's progressing that gets harder because as you ow, as you begin to progress, you're gonna need more damage, and that's ultimately where a lot of builds begin to fall short because they don't have the damage that's needed to to kill the higher level bosses and whatnot He teleported back to the base. That might be enough to unlock the next region. We'll see. Do we have Otake Maru?
Damn, still not. Well, I guess next we'll finish Shadow. But I'm gonna do some scrolls real fast since I got some hundred essence. Fighting here. Is this an Roki Maglagara? It is. Maybe attack increase winded enemy. Mortal Shell will be up on the day it's up. Dodge key consumption, luck, shift. I probably gotta check gear, see what my, my gear is at. Uh, damn, 518, yeah, all right, hold up. The blacksmith, we go. Let's see, we're almost, we're almost matched up. We're almost matched all the way. 17, 16, 15, we got a 14. Nari's Grace with a Star Scorch. Alright, let's match the 12s. And uh, I need a 13. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Sixteen. Seventeen. And eighteen. One more. Just one more thing. Uh, the bow. We have any... We have a plus ten. And that's it. Okay. What about armor? We're at 17 on all the armor. The closest is like a 15. I don't know why these pieces are locked. I'm wearing them. Umbersite fragments. I'm full. Oh, hell no, we're not. Um... Dookie, untouched elixir, untouched clay bell. I will need untouched clay bell later. Oh, wait, when did I, I had a Yasukani drop. When did that happen? Ooh, well, that's my Makatama. I was like, oh, fuck, that looks good. And then I was like, wait, that's fine. Do not remember getting a plus 12... Yasukani. Um.
These two, I'm going to use, I'm going to re-roll this to get something dupe like that. Mm, okay. Um, sell, sell. Usable items. Oh man, I have like a bajillion number side fragments. How am I at 9999 Umbra site? Utensils. Lots of 170. Bam battle results. Red team's always winning, man. Your clan position. Minister. I think that's the highest my rank goes. Let me check. Individual. Um, wait, donate. Wait, where do I see my, my rank? Hang on, I gotta go to, I gotta transfer to luck, I think. Uh, wait, who am I in? Oh, that's not who I'm in. What the hell? There we go. That's who I'm in. Active skill, key damage, and melee damage. Nailing. Damn it. Where is the thing that... Oh, here we go. Right here. Minister. Is this the highest? So I'm at 10% and 8. Uh, clan ranks. You have two. Um... All clan rank, max bonuses. Let's see, we are looking for Takenaka. Uh, it goes up to eight and ten, so we are max. Probably want where luck is the highest. It's gonna cut my money down, but I'll just leave it. Mmm, nine million. Feeling good. Alright, back to the scrolls. I'm gonna get this attack increase winded enemy sooner or later. No more gamo? Nah. I switched off gamo because this clan, the 5% bonus is active as soon as I apply in a, a, any kind of element, which purity, water, fire, you know, whatever the case is, I get something up very quickly. Um. And then...
That feel when you accidentally kill the guy. I never look at this shit I pick up. Which now that I'm thinking about it, there's a chance that I may have picked up like a star piece of Ben's gear and I wouldn't have even known it. And I would have just thrown it away. Without ever knowing. But if it's not the Ben's I need, it's a count. <clears throat> Oh shit! Ah, uh, ah. Uh, that's the bonus, but do I want to give up ten percent active skill key damage? Ah. Uh, I mean, rolling a nine point nine again isn't gonna happen. But that's what I've been looking for. I don't think I can do it. I think I need to just... I think I need to pass on it. Well, you can't. You gotta... This will turn into increased attack. This will turn into low attack key consumption. And 10% key damage. I mean, key damage is key damage. But that's the bonus I've been trying to get. <sighs> I mean, eventually I'll have what I need. As ideally, why do you want that? It doesn't stack because I'm not using anything it conflicts with. So it would stack with everything that I'm using. The only thing, I mean, I have Yamnaba on right now, but that's a filler. I'd much rather have that over Yamnaba. the way with the amount of key damage this build does it would be up constantly because we bottom people out of key almost instantly so I'd be picking up the increased defense winded I'd be having the increased attack winded uh, and then I'd have faster key recovery coming in from Yumihami so just attack key and defense all in one nice little package
But I mean, the stat numbers for the winded, let me see. It wasn't in the buff index earlier, but I'll look, see if they added it yet. Actually, is I don't think Ocean's in here. Let me just, let me just ping him. Luck. Yeah, I'll take more luck, I guess. Twenty-five percent. Twenty-five is respectable. I would take that. Mainly because I don't, I don't like doing Yamnaba and Nupepo. It's just annoying to have to stack them. So if I have increased attack winded, I could drop this out and uh, let me see. I mean, there's a couple that I could put on that would be decent choices here, I think. So we were, we were running Namahage, um, this one. So that's picking up an extra 7.2% against zero key. So just more zero key damage. Um, if I didn't run him, got so many fucking Yokis. I didn't run him. Uh, I could go for a minus one Nurikabe. Big thick boy. Or a minus one Wyra to dodge moves. Or a minus... No, I couldn't do Nue. It would be too much. I just don't, <clears throat> I don't know, I hate, I hate going into fights and having to like, because since, since uh, old hag is only going to last for 10 seconds, I got a new Peppo, and then Yamnaba, and then do damage. No more Night Essence. What was this? Oh, I can sprint through this one. And the Discord, they're saying it's 20%. 20% isn't that good. Twenty-five, I could be like, all right, well, it's half, half, but not complete ass. Twenty, I'm like, ooh. Twenty, I'm not two point five times strong. Yeah, stop that. Yeah, I mean, the whole, really, all you can do is like pop Yamnaba or a uh, pop. Pop new Peppo since he's 20. And then pop Yamnaba right after. And then, damn it, this is not the way I want to go. Out of my way, doggo. I'm not here for y'all. Y'all are wasting my time. And like right after you do old hag, you go into your dragon dance or whatever you're using to do damage. This way? Isn't it like... I know, I'm trying to run backwards through this one, so I'm going up here, I think. What are your thoughts on Omyo Anima Gain Otaku Maru spam? Otaku Maru spam is boring. Otaku Maru is alright as a nuke. But doing entire builds centered around just spamming Otaku Maru 
is the same tier as like bow builds that just paralyze in one shot. Like, will it work? Yeah, sure. Is it fun to play? That is a different story. I came from here. Out of my way, fucker. My thing is, I want something, regardless, if I'm playing something, it needs to be A, powerful, that much is obvious, and B, fun to play. Doing one-handed builds and just punching stuff and it dying, not fun. Sitting and charging up a bow shot to hit something in the face for like a bajillion damage, not fun. Um, how do I gotta do the sexy lay? There it is. Hello. Yeah, plus that. Otakumaru is only going to be good against stuff that's bigger. Trying to use it on anything that's small, it kind of just falls off. I'm 25 with some initial test done by someone on Discord. But last week, looks like they solidified. Yeah, Flash Attack just said it is... Uh, 20% in Discord. Mm, God, how many more? We're so close. Jesus, it's gotta be like two missions. Trying of Oaths. Knocked out both of those. Oh, that one's a pain in the ass. This one is just killing stuff. Well, if it's only 20, maybe I don't need it. Maybe I just keep luck on there or something else. Well, the duration... See, I wouldn't worry about duration, because the thing is, we're, we're constantly bottoming stuff out of key. Like, I'm not even using, like, the good key move. That's more of a, a Tom... If I was to use Tomfas, it would just be perpetual out of key, out of key, out of key, out of key. Like here, I'll, I'll show you our our key destroying capabilities. So, we just use this move, and that thing's key is gone. for my build if it's a long duration. My guess would be uh, probably 20 seconds. That's how long the attack winded defense is, so it's probably the same duration as that. I should make another Ben's weapon, though. I mean, Tompas make the most sense. Like, if we're... If we're looking at his stat-wise, I'll have the body and I have the courage. So I think making Ben's Tompas would be good. Um, but I might be able to go even higher. Oh, I just... Discord...
Yeah. So what should I put on there? I mean, luck isn't terrible. No, I'm both surprised and overwhelmed. Oh yeah. Neo is, is right there next to Monster Hunter in terms of how much time it's going to, to eat up in your life. Key damage. Uh, I don't make it to this one yet. No, we did. We did that one. That one. Both buffs. I'm a god for ten seconds. Ten seconds is all I need. Oh. Boom, 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 boom. Two eighty life. Yeah, but I mean, I have, uh, my ad. I have 5,100. Like, do I need 280? Colton with the dono hype. Thank you, Colton. Now, Tava's a fun weapon. It's just, it's, it's super fluid. Constant pressure on the enemy, just right up in their face. It's a really nice weapon all around. I could also dual sword, but if I'm going to dual sword... I'd want to spec more into heart. Uh, I mean, I could go back to untouched Omeo, have a 5.9. That's basically perfect rolls, I think, for melee, untouched, and active skill. What do you guys think? 27 luck? Or do I just say fuck it and keep untouched Omeo on there? It's a 5.9. That's a solid roll. Chat, what do you think? Is an active skill damage? Oh, I have melee damage, so I don't think I can get active skill damage. Go for luck. Really? I wish I could like see my overall stats. So it's for me, unless you are farming, true. I mean, my untouched is already pretty high. With that, my untouched is probably like close to 30. Without it, I'm about 25. If you have most of that, that is true. Yeah, I do have just pretty much everything in the game. Uh. I'm gonna go back to untouched. I'm gonna go untouched. Cause with that, that puts me at Oh god, I wish this fucking list was alphabetical so much. 26.2 untouched. That's pretty nice. Not that one. Let's try and this one's kinda quick. Ooh, this one has a samurai lock though. Let's do that.
Can't you change the color rarities though? Yeah. Follow your heart. Shifting point. Um, does Sudama friend help with rerolls? I don't think so. Um, what do I want? I don't fuck with raging strike. Hmm. <laughs> Let's just take the scampus up longer. You gotta save his ass. It's a better build, sword build than toxic. You can update it on or some of your old build. She's Ben's man. Choose Benz. Use the latest build I uploaded. It's the best build in the game. And you use exactly what I'm using right now, except you just use dual circles. That's it. And everything just dies. Everything dies. Scrolls are alright, but like if you're trying to just kill shit with kunai, that ain't gonna work out.
Yeah, unless versatility gets a nerf or everything else gets a buff. This will basically this is basically the best build until Dream of the Neo. Because the biggest thing is you can customize this to a number of things. If you want to do Scorch, you can pick up extra Scorch damage. You want to do Lightning, you can pick up extra Lightning damage. I went for a balanced approach where I do extra key damage. You want to do Grapple? You could do pure Grapple damage. Are you fucking kidding? We still don't have this shit? Oh my god. We're like, we're, we're literally on the line. One more mission. Shrine of Oats. I'm pretty sure I can sprint through this shit. Which one is this? Grapple and key would complement each other. Personally, I think going key damage is better because you have more key damage, you're getting more grapples. Um, I don't think the grapple set's that good. I mean, you're a little bit, uh, you're a little bit stronger with the grapple set. But the grapple set is basically giving you like a 30% bonus to your grapple, which I think there are much, much better stats to invest in over a 30% grapple increase, you know? Sorry, it's this little thing in the corner. <sighs> I hate how many missions you need to do to unlock regions in Dream of the Demon. I wish they'd just give you all regions. Yeah, but... Progression. Yeah, Banky's a solid choice. I don't know how Banky would handle um, at the very end. I think uh, like DLC, Dream of the Demon, that Banky might suffer a little bit. But um, yeah, I mean, it's, it's probably does pretty well. Blue-eyed samurai, eye of the beholder. All right, let's go beat William's ass. You got booped, William.
No! Ah, shit. I let him... Come here. Conscious as to, dude, I'm right there with you, Truth. I have never, I've never broken a keyboard. I've never broken a mouse, a controller, a monitor. Like, the idea of getting so angry that you break something that you paid for? Like, the worst I've gotten is I've punched a hole in a wall before, like drywall. But, like, actually break it. Like, I can't imagine getting angry and being like, fuck this, and breaking something that I had to work and earn money to buy. What the fuck? Why would you do that? Find a way to boost the spin to win build? I mean... You could do like bends with a katana and like build your, your stacks all the way up and then when you get to nine stacks, spin to win. So we're going to go back to summoning people in a little bit, but I need to... Let's go. I mean, this mission already has the whole fucking gang along. I want to see if we can solo good old Takemaru. Um, actually, it's been so long since I've run it. Is it... Is it that? And then this way? And then this way? Ah, ah, oh god, no. Fart rat, stop it. Yeah, I know. You drop down and then you do this, right? And I just go this way to get back up top. Excuse me. Remember where the fuck I'm going. It's been that long since I gotta get. Don't I gotta like get up? No, wait. No, no, no. That's right. He's behind the gate. Damn it. Where's the. Where's the gate? It's the gate. I, I was running like I'm going to shoot and doji. I wanna go back this way. And, uh, probably, maybe, I don't have time for y'all. Out of my way. All right, the gate is there, to the left. So I wanted to go this way. No, wait. No, wait, fuck, I'm getting, oh, god damn it. I ended up misdirected again. Got that nice Magatsu core. 
It's been too long. Uh, out of my way. Out of my way. Yo, poor William and Mumio, they're just lost. They're more lost than I am. Ow, ow, you little bitch. Get out of here. I just gotta get over to there. Uh, no, this wasn't turned before. So you go, don't you just drop down? No, we just did that and that was not it, right? Wait, no, that is it. No, that's not it. What the shit? Excuse me, sir. I am lost. It's been a long time. If you could assist with some directions. You don't want to die, do you? Ah, there it is. See, I was trying to get to the hot spring all along. I was just trying to get them that done. Look at, <laughs> look at William! <laughs> oh, shit. Right down there. Oh, it's that. It's that way then, right? I just gotta drop and go that. Way. No, it's the bottom floor. So I gotta get down to the bottom floor. <coughs> no, it's not the bottom floor. God damn it! Where's the fucking thing at? And I, how do I turn the fucking stairs back, bro? The stairs won't turn back once you've done this. Oh my god. Bottom tier. Dude, I, it's been a while, alright? It's been... I haven't had to farm Otakamaru in a long time, okay? This is a dead end. Oh my god. Oh my god. I don't have time for you, Birdman. On this, yeah, right? On this episode of Lost, will Cowboy find his way to the boss? See, this is actually, uh, this is walkthrough prep right now. We are simulating what it's like for a new player to come here the first time so that I can really get in the role of that experience and understand uh, their frustrations. It's a very important part of, of making a walkthrough. You need to understand the struggles that your audience is going to face. And so this is a, this is a huge part of that, you know? People are, are going to have the similar problem. And, you know, I would not be dare I say, the top tier creative that I am uh, if I didn't understand the problems of the audience who comes to me for my Neo Guidance. Well, this this is for this is the prep for a new series called the struggles of neo where we go in depth to the things that will make you upset such as uh getting lost uh save scumming rng uh tempering for star effects uh 
dealing with accidentally erasing gear that you did not mean to. Realizing that your weapon doesn't do enough key damage to stop something. These are all very, very uh, common problems. You're in my way. Oh, God damn it. No, get out of here, crazy man. Holy shit. Bro, listen, I'm not here to fight you. I'm here to kill her. real quick yes I've made changes That was nothing compared to Demon of Hatred. Dude, Demon of Hatred can eat a dick. Um, um, I remember the walkthrough prep for Demon of Hatred. Oh my god. So many fights to get that down. Um... You know, Otaku Maru's fight is so damn long. I don't think it's worth buffing up versatility yet anyway. Let's get into the fight. Clap and eat, clap. I need you to stay still so I can just kill you, please, sir. Blah, 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 blah. Okay. 
Look, he's doing his own dragon dance. That like a bitch. I don't know why I thought that was going to be a challenge. It was harder to get through the level than it was to kill the boss. Yasukani Magatama. Yeah, at all, Otakamaru? Gross. Alright, the new Yasukani is a plus 12, and you're also a plus 12, so we got two plus 12 Yasas now. Lock and move to storehouse. <clears throat> um, I should take care of rolling. Because I'm going to have to roll melee damage for a zero key. It's going to take ages. No, I'll save that for a different time. Um, What is this one? Oh, this is like a bunch of yokai. This is the... Which is the one where... Which is the dojo winds of ruin? I think that's the dojo one. Hey, you can transmogrify. <coughs> Should have made a save scum point here for a guaranteed Yasukani. I mean, the we, we got the guaranteed Yasukani. What do you mean make a save scum point? I didn't even use this. I haven't used that in ages. Listen, man, hey, hey, stop this. I'm still trying to get all my buffs up. Bro, no! Oh my god. Goku didn't. get away from this guy before he does some bullshit. That was a bad idea.
Kato doing annoying shit. Big surprise there. Nope, I'm dead. God damn it. Yeah, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need something more aggressive. I like split staff, but I need to make Tomfos just for the, the human battles, I think. Because I just, I just knock them back too much. Unless I'm relying on just my one... My one move. This guy. I mean, I can't do this. But it's kind of boring playing like that. So I just gotta, I gotta spam my one ability here. I do a just had to abuse Shinbreaker. Ma, Anata ni steva, Yoko yatta hodawa. Yeah, well, that's like I wanted to have Gozuki on, but I really like Kasha. And if I put on Gozuki, I gotta replace Kasha. And so I'm like, mm. I mean, yes, Gozuki claps, but Kasha, you just let it rip, man. Just bah, 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 bah. She just destroys. I don't know what happened because I died. But the, since when does that mission not, uh, not reset back to start? Is a Nagi drop? That's in uh, Neo. They added it in the first Neo as well. This is the uh, this is the one where you fight all like three bosses, right? I mean, I could just make a pair of Tomfas and just 
destroy key with that. Tompas for human, split staff for, for yokai. I mean, most of the time it wouldn't matter, but on like certain missions, like that one right there, I'll just mix it up and use the Tompas instead. Fuck, what was that shit? Transference. No, nope, my buffs! Oh, I can't. No, they fell off. Oh, no. The slow. Oh, you bitch. Wait, how did I even die? My health went up. Oh my god. God, I died in middle mid Yam Naba. I mean, it didn't help. I need I needed another uh, I needed another impurity. Yeah, because the confusion is what got me at the end.
Are they dying already? God damn, they're all so beefy. I didn't even have my... I didn't have my quick change on. I need to have on my thing. I need to get my stacks up appropriately. Stop moving, please. Oh my god, holy shit, dude. There you go, enjoy that. Dude, this like super cursed version of Otaku Maru is ass.
Jesus, he just instantly hits you with confusion, bro. He's gonna stand still and get his ass beat for once. Oh shit. Get in there. Keep me alive. Dude, I don't remember half of these moves. What the fuck? I know this is his... Yeah. How, like, half of this shit I've never seen before. Like, his crazy, uh... His crazy fucking giant key laser thing? What is that? Yeah, a sake would be good. Sake would be good. Uh, I mean, that's, I mean, because yeah, that, that is what's killing me. Um, where do I want to put it? Put it up here. Oh my god, this is shit again.
Yeah, just needed to bring out the sake. That's a super fucking tankier Takamaru, though. Like, that was way, way tankier than the, the story one. Like, just damage. Ridiculous. Trying to fight him with three people? I mean, I'd assume it would be easier, wouldn't it? Or do they just scale his health up to, like, absurd fucking levels to where it's not fun or something? Got lots of cores, though. Tell you what, if you ever wanted to farm up a good Yatsu core, this is the place to do it. I don't even remember what the other ones were, but I'm not that worried about them. Um, what time is it anyway? Yeah, we could probably fuck with the DLC a little bit. Um... First DLC. I'm not worried about the first mission. Man, I really want to do a build around Umiudo. He's so much fun. Maybe like a Banky Lightning build that's focused on like lightning and saturation and using that core could be fun. Or a ben, Ben's build, not not Banky. I don't know why I said Banky. The devs say they would tone down difficulty in higher New Game Plus modes. I mean, we'll see. Because I remember in the first one, that's that's ultimately the problem with Neo. Like, I, Way of the Strong is a fun difficulty. And Way of the Demon, things start to ramp up, but you have some cool sets. So it's like, alright, you know, it's still good. Um, but once you get into, like, Wise and Neo, it becomes more of a question of, you know how OP is your gear like it stops being about whether or not you're actually I mean obviously you still need to be a great player but it uh I don't know man it's just it's not the same once you get to like that difficulty it's like either you have a set that is mad OP and you're gonna just destroy everything or you're gonna die like that's it. Those are your options. Either destroy everything or die. Mm, where do I even want to spend this point, man? There's like nothing I need. And the Omeo magics are ass. Maybe I should try out Geyser Shot, see if it's better than the feathers. I don't know, man. Geyser Shot. What does the lightning one do? Or if I'm going to do anything, the Shikigamis are usually pretty good. You toss those out, and they're usually, like, instant application. I mean, skill play still plays a part, but I agree that it's it's all about whether or not you have the numbers more than anything. Save it for what? I can just respec... Life seal, I guess. Bring it down to four. Oh boy. Anyway, let's pull some people in. We'll sprint through this shit and. This is a long episode. Or a long, uh, long zone. 
Isn't there a thing? This was... Purity shot? Maybe. I mean, I have purity on the split staff. But given that I have 99 magic, purity shot would probably be a smarter option. No! Oh! I figured for sure I'd be able to catch that, that ledge. Sorry, Kamina. Leave Odachi is the strongest weapon? I would completely disagree with that. Odachi isn't even in like the top three strongest weapons. No, why am I not rolling? Bro, this is some dookie. If we're looking strictly at how strong a weapon is, right now, Split Staff is probably the strongest. Only because it has its own self buff that doesn't conflict with anything else. Um, following that, probably Tomfa, because Inagi is ridiculous for dodging. Um, and then on top of having access to Inagi, Tampa also does just tons and tons of key damage, which in higher difficulties is like amazing. Um, it's a big glowy bubble, but uh, dual swords with their defensive buff are like just they have insane damage and insane tank ability at the same time. So they're incredibly potent. Um, and then after those, I would probably say spear. Well, either, I don't know, either spear or switchglaive. Because switch, if you're really, really good with switchglaive, you can get buffed up and do some mean fucking damage. But spear in general just has the kit that spear has available. Like the stuff you can use in spear, whether you're fighting humans or yokai. Spear has a very nice moveset. It's like a. I need to kill. You know, I can just walk past your ass. Yeah, duels. That's why I love dual swords so much. Because dual swords, dual swords. You, the tankiness that you have is, it's just insane, man. You are, you are. So tanky with dual swords once you get your mind's eye buff up. For some reason, I remember this level being a lot longer, but we're actually like hauling ass. We're almost through this. Well, we're up to the part where we meet up with him. Coolest grapple? That goes to Tafa. Easy, easy win for Tampa. Tampa's grapple is a multi-hit combo that looks like something out of a kung fu movie. Your dude's like, ba 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 ba. Like Tampa is just good. After that, I would give it to Split Staff because Split Staff yoinking yoinking somebody up in the air by their neck and then slamming them down. That's dope. Then probably switch wave, because you go up around the neck and then slam them down. He's a bubble butt. This was actually a really short level. I hadn't run through this before. 
but it's actually pretty pretty easy to run through this level. Yeah, Odachi just slams him down. Odachi grapple is boring. Well, Merciless Barrage is a special ability. We're talking about base grapples. I mean, special ability grapples are, are a different story altogether. Because then you're, you're taking into consideration things like how much damage does that do? Like, for the longest time, Merciless Barrage, like, it looked great, but honestly, the move itself was kind of ass. Like, it didn't really hurt people. Is there one more? No, we're good. All right. Wait, why didn't I just do the 1v1 mission against him? That would have made so much more sense. Enjoy the purity. It's yours now. Enjoy the Kasha. I don't think this is even gonna work. He, he moves too damn much. Yep, I was like, I don't know why I'm even trying this move. Nope, don't do that. Don't do the bird. Damn, I didn't do enough key damage to your ass! Got me with the anime finish. kidding me? I made it all the way up there and died to some fucking swords. I came all the way here and he wants to be on some bullshit. Mm. Mm -mm -mm. Full boss movesets? I mean, then it wouldn't be Neo. I didn't notice my thing fell off. That's ass. I might need to put on, uh, put on Big Bull, to be honest.
Oh shit. Your keys never ending, bro. How do I keep dying to this fucking sword thing, bro? Like the fight's going good. I'm dodging, I'm hitting, I'm, I'm keeping versatility up. And then just super swords. You know what? Fuck this. We're stomping this guy. He's going to play nice, but he wants to play like a bitch. I'm going to pull in the speedy boys, and we're just going to beat him into the ground. I don't even care. Snickers, nah, I do. I did pick up some nice looking steaks for dinner, though. Longer you take to kill him, the worse your odds of winning. Yeah, I think that the thing is, my my quick change is running off. No, yeah, he's getting his ass beat. I'm just fucking up and getting hit by some shitty move. Against me is how he has a literal unstoppable. Like his key regens so fucking quick, dude. There you go. You enjoy that purity. It's not mine, it's yours. Yeah, even then, even with having everybody, he almost killed my ass again with the with the fucking swords. The swords almost killed me again. Fucking swords is mean, man. Huh. 
I got 20 minutes. Uh, I do actually need to farm his skill for the for the next walkthrough. I'm sure it's harder in the duel. No, well, honestly, where I'm at, I need to do. I need to re-roll. I need to. I need to replace this with a new one that's like nice and pimped out. Um. I want to get this up to plus twenty, which actually I might have the parts I need to do that. Let me see. Let me see. Sixteen. Ugh. There's a sixteen. A couple thirteens. I can make a fourteen. Sixteen and a fifteen. Madonna. Yeah, well, well, so what I wanted to do since, um, I did, uh, tried three different sets with them on the dual Benz, Red Demon, Benz, and Nari. And Benki. Why would you try Benki? Benki doesn't hit its attack bonus. Well, Veteran's by far the easiest. Yeah, just the, the mitigate, mid attack damage thing. I'm going to farm him for a little bit. So this is, I do, I don't need a ton of time on this save, but so for the next, since we did dual swords, um, for the next walkthrough, I'm going to do katana because everybody wanted katana. The vote, the vote was, uh, the vote was katana right below dual swords. Like I did a poll for what weapon we should use. So for a DLC two, we're going to do walkthrough with katana. And I'd gotten most of the set prepped. I got I got full set and I got some, some decent things on it. Nothing crazy, but you know, it's alright, but I, I mean I don't know. The thing is on like this is I mean this is obviously just a new game build. But only being at B toughness kinda hurts, not gonna lie. And then uh I, the the big problem right now is I was gonna run his set. But I don't even have fucking Karama Sword Dance. Which if I'm gonna... If I am going to, to use this set for the walkthrough, I need Karama Sword Dance, obviously. Only using Steel. Yeah, I don't even have the, the Master Omeo thing. I got them slow-ass casts.
Oh no. Don't stop, please don't. Take nah, 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 nah. that. I don't know. Should I like what do y'all think? Do I gotta farm up? So I'm gonna use this set, I gotta farm up the weapon art, right? The other thing is, since since the walkthroughs are done on New Game, I don't want to use a Yasukani. I mean, you can use a Yasukani. You can get it in DLC now. But I'm kind of like, eh. I feel like that's... That's min-maxing. Too much. But right now, I don't have... Uh, like, what is my item drop and all that? My item drop is 14%. Ain't that good. I think I'd rather use like a Night Rain Yoshi build than Kurama build. Like I already specced out the gear, so I'm kind of like, uh... Well, I mean, you might get a Yasukani from the DLC. You're not guaranteed to, though. Do I want to keep this set? If I was going to do a katana build. If you if you were going to do a katana build on new game. Do you think this set is worth it? Because I mean try. If we're talking to straight damage. I feel like the only reason to use this set. As if I'm using Kurama Sword Dance, because I'd be doing, I'd be doing better damage, uh, just running, um, what's it called? The uh, Triumph of Tranquility, mixed with Yatsu. But it is kind of nice to be like, oh man, look at this cool. This is from the last DLC. Yeah, I do like Night Rain, but the Night Rain set is, what, three, three piece, which I'd get rid of my attack bonus skill if I did that. If I was going to go Night Rain, I'd have to get a Yasukani. Because I'd have to, I think I have the sword, actually. Shida, is it a Shida Masamu? Yeah, like, I don't have anything, man. I'd have to have somebody, like, drop the gear, basically. Because I do not have the the sets I would need. That's that's the biggest problem with doing walkthroughs on Neo, is, like... Like, my main character has fucking everything. But I can't... I can't use him. 
I can't use my main character to do the walkthrough. Because he's fucking, uh... You know, he's in, like, god gear. Yeah, that's what I wanted to do. But I'd have to have a Yasukani, and then I feel like people would probably bitch in the walkthrough, like, Oh, well, I don't have that set thing. And I could probably, like... Like, I didn't even bother going in Herits. So I was trying to keep it with, like, a gear that you would probably have on New Game. It's so, like, I rolled attack. I rolled night rain damage there. Even the gear is, like, super basic. I mean, I, I managed to get this drop... The drop for Karama Swordmaster pretty easily. And then I just put a uh, lightning on it because lightning's always good to have. And some basic inherits and then purity swords. I just feel like I should get the sword skill. If I'm gonna use this. I should get sword skill. Maybe Gallant and Yosh with Kingo. I mean, if you're gonna use Yosh, though. Like, <clears throat> at a bare minimum, I could have the weapon and the senior flute for the attack defense 15. And then I could go Gallant, but Gallant as a set isn't that good. Um, let me pull up the, the set list here. The Gallant bonus is... what's Gallant? Yeah, Gallant is... 4% melee damage, 20% strong attack key consumption. So Gallant's only worth it for the three piece for Night Rain. Which if I'm using that, if I'm using a Gallant set, I'm going to be using it for... Like, it, basically it's pointless to use Gallant if I'm not using um, a Yasukani. do pretty good damage for for it being only a new game build like we're not gonna instantly kill bosses how we would if we were running a, a like a, a way of the strong build obviously I just want Kurama Sword Dance, but he ain't fucking dropping it. Which I actually think... Do I have? Yes, yeah, so I don't have any of the sword stuff. I don't know. Maybe I just shouldn't use a sword for the walkthrough. I don't fucking know, man. Use the Akechi set for Shadow Sword. What's the... Uh Catchy set does, uh... That one does what? The, uh, is it this one? The Flowing Shadow on the Catchy set? 
Yeah, flowing shadow, three piece, and then active skill key damage, increase attack omyo hit. It's not bad, but then I'm like half synergizing into omyo. Use the sword. All right, I don't, I don't have a Yasakani. Using the sword isn't gonna benefit me at all. Oh, we did, we did axe for the whole general walkthrough, which like it's good when people are first getting into the game. But beyond that, I feel like you know you kind of people have have figured out what weapons they want and what they're gonna use. The other thing is we're still using Tengen, because I'll need Tengen to track all the fucking items for the DLC, so that's gonna be ass just by itself. Why you gotta be all up on top of me with this bullshit? Okay. Stop with the anime teleports and shit, bro. I think my thing is if I'm using katana if I'm using katana with this set I should have Kurama Sword Dance because why the fuck would you use the Kurama Sword Dance set if you don't have Kurama Sword Dance did I get the grapple set maybe I could do that See, I don't think I got the grapple set. I mean, to be fair, this deal, the the next deal. Oh, I did. Could do that. But that's also like, uh, that's another one that's like, it, this set would be better off doing, like half and half, because you're not going six piece on this. You'll never fucking move. Set's so goddamn heavy. I just want Kurama Sword Dance. I'll give it like one more, and if you don't drop it, then fuck him. Cause I want to go make a steak anyway. I mean, when the DLC comes out, I might be too busy to do a walkthrough anyway. Let me let me see. I'm curious. Because Neo, once you, once you get into the DLCs, Neo is something that's more for. Like, either you're playing it or you're not. Yeah, like, the DLCs only did, for all the work on the walkthrough, it netted, like, 5,000 views an episode. It's, like, the same shit as Grounded. So maybe just not bother with the 100% walkthrough for the DLCs. Just say, fuck it, do the Let's Play, have fun with it. Well, I got 
Why did I use that? I didn't want to use that. Bro, no, I wanted to use this. Give me the shit, man. The fucking skill. I think part of it is like a walkthrough is gonna be super guided compared to let's play. ass I want my thing I know I'm not gonna get it probably I'm wasting my time They ain't gonna give it to me. I mean, I'd probably be fine without it. The other thing I could do, I'd have to... I'd have to choose Kodama Blessing and wear your bowl. No, I'm not wearing my bowl. I don't even have a bowl on this. This is the literally the only time I play this build is for the walkthrough. Otherwise, there's no point. There's no point. Like, everything we do is on the normal build, you know? Why... Why bother with, with this build when I could be doing the other build, you know? Anyway, let's... Uh, I'm gonna hop back over to Demon. I'll, I'll fight this dickhead on Demon with the regular build. And then after that, we'll wrap things up for the night. What was crazy, I mean, half the reason I decided to do the Katana build is because he dropped his set on the kill. The first kill, he dropped the set. I'm like, well, fuck, if you're just going to hand me Karama set, I might as well use it. We are back, though. I'm going to pee.
Okay, let me, um... I'm gonna try it out with the bull. I'm gonna pull my bull out. Where are you at, bull? Where is Mizuki? Where is... Where the hell is Mizuki? How am I not seeing Mizuki? There we go. No, I want Gozuki. This is this my Gozuki? That's my Gozuki. Yeah. Oh wait, I gotta go back west. Three builds, the bends, my Omeo spam, and a luck armor set. Yeah, I mean, I have builds for everything, but thankfully, with the bends, that's not needed. Though, in theory, I should... I should craft uh, these two... these two pieces with, like, active skill damage. I doubt there's, like, an active skill inheritable just laying around, but that would be super nice. Unfortunately, I don't think that's going to happen. Bro, we tickle him. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no. No, oh fuck, that's the super sword attack right there. It's 
stay there for a second. Stay there for like 10 seconds. Come on. No! Oh my god, he got me. I thought I dodged that shit. A lot easier fighting him here than that little ass bridge. Oh, What's funny is I don't even play Katana on this character. But I have the smithing for that set. I have Kurama Sword Dance. I have uh, Sacred Bird Cry or whatever. Like I have everything on this character. Which is also why... I could not use it for the- I mean, technically, would I- If I really wanted it to be cute, what I could do... This would be kind of fucked. <laughs> I could respec back down to, like, say, level 200. And keep all my Amrita inside an Amrita crystal. And make a backup set. To use for a new game with, with this character. <laughs> Uh, that'd be pretty funny though. That'd be some some serious like what the fuck? It'd be funny as hell. Um, let's go do the wait. I don't have the one on one with Banky yet, do I? I know I do. All right, let's go spank Bank. Banky getting spanky, and then we're gonna go to bed. No, we're back on our our Dream of the Demon character. Why not respec and play dual swords on this character? I used to. This character was dual swords uh, until... In fact, this character... I was gonna be dual swords for the DLC. But instead, uh, DLC came out and was like, let me introduce you to split staff. And I was like, oh. This is sexy. Oh no, Banky! Banky, what is happening to you? Banky just getting abused. Wait, oh shit! Yo, that fire is crazy strong, bro! Damn! He fucking reset everything! Thank you, I gotta get my stacks back up. Why couldn't you just have stayed and got your ass beat? What a pain in the ass this is. Stop.
Banky more like a yokai than a person, so I can just put him in a corner. That I can't believe how much damage that fire did though, man. That fire caught me in the ground and just my health was like ba 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 da. Just dead. With that done, um, I think we're gonna wrap up. I mean, we 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 beat what's his face, we beat Banky. I didn't get dance on the weaker character, but I mean, honestly, we might not even return to it by the time the next DLC comes, because the DLC is gonna probably come out in like October, and I'll be busy with other games. So I'm probably just gonna I'm probably just gonna do the, the like the let's play and streams and whatnot. Anyway, uh, y'all have a good night. Tomorrow's plan, tentatively, For Honor. I say tentative because For Honor got pretty janky with the last patch. Uh, so I'm not sure if we're going to keep playing it. They're, they're supposedly patching it like today. But I would... Um, but I plan on doing because I'm off work tomorrow. So I'm going to jump on whenever I wake up. I'm going to see if it's like really weird or whatever the case is. Like if it's still, if it's still shitty, we're not going to play it and we'll just do Fall Guys tomorrow night. If it is not shitty, we'll do For Honor and then some Fall Guys afterwards. Uh, so that should be fun. So anyway, y'all have a good night. I'm going to go make me a steak and I'll catch you guys. I'll probably do more Neo next. Well, I don't know. Maybe Neo, maybe Mortal Shell. We'll figure it out when next week comes. Anyway, see you guys later.